Hi, and welcome to Builder Your TV. We're here at PCBC 2009 with the U.S. Department of Energy. Hi, George. Hi. How are you doing today? Well, just fine. It's a good show, even though it's a little smaller than <laughs> it's, last it's year. It's a little bit smaller, but... Uh, no, can, we're getting a lot of it. A lot, a lot of people coming by, yeah. right? Can, can you tell me a little bit first about the U.S. Department of Energy and what you do? Well, U.S. Department of Energy, part of our activity is what we call our building technology program. And under that, we're working with builders to help them build houses that use less energy. Great. And uh, over the last 10 years since we started the Building America program, mm -hmm. we've learned pretty much how a builder can build a house that's saving 35% of the whole house energy at no additional cost, maybe 1 or 2%. And we have 33,000 houses in the country now that are using, that are meeting yeah. that standard. Great. Now, the yeah. thing is, what we've learned, mm -hmm. because our program is a voluntary program, right. and I have seven Building America teams across the country. Uh -huh. Here, uh, the team we uh, have is Bureau or Consul. Uh -huh. uh, they work with the builders. They work with the builders, not tell them what to do, right. but it's a joint program with the builders to build energy efficient houses. Yeah. Now, the problem has been, how do you rate an energy efficient house? Yeah, exactly. You know, we have green program, green this and uh -huh. that and so on. Of course, so what we've done is working with the, in California, it'll be with uh, the tiers mm -hmm. rating group. They will do a rating on the house. Okay. Uh, and if the house comes out to a 70 or less, It'll be what we call a builder challenge house, right. and they actually will get the certificate mm -hmm. that goes in the house. Oh, great. But we're also trying to get the point across to all the mm -hmm. programs, and we're trying to work with uh, Leeds, uh, Energy Star, mm -hmm. uh, NHB Green program, that this scale can be used by everybody. I see. So maybe if you have an Energy Star house, uh -huh. maybe it comes out as 85, uh -huh. but that still would have a certificate. I see. So these standards will integrate with some of the other certification yeah. and regulations. Yeah, we're trying programs. to work with everyone. Oh, great. So how, how exactly do you, does uh, build, well, build the American Well, that's one reason I'm, I'm out here today yeah. to talk to this, with the cheers uh -huh. people on how we can work with them, because right. the, the requirements with Title 24 uh -huh. are gonna be a little bit different than they are, say, in, yeah. in Nevada, uh -huh. uh, where we have uh, like 600 houses that meet the energy, uh -huh. uh, meet our builder challenge. Spe yeah. Speaking of Title 24, can you talk a little bit about it and some of the new regulations and what's going on well, with legislation uh, in terms of, of you know, uh, Basically, energy? being the over project manager, I have people that really worry about those tiny details. Right, right. The main thing is that the regulations will be changing in August. Uh -huh. They'll become more stringent. Okay. And part of the problem is which of the energy rating uh -huh. software programs oh, are used to do that. Cool. So uh, I've got some charts there back in my book I brought right. out. Uh, we still have some consolidation to do. Uh -huh. But the thing is, Department of Energy wants to work with her. We, we right. don't want to have this be a mandated thing. Right, we right. want everyone to buy into To it. want to do it, to want yeah. to do it. So, for, for instance, San Francisco has a lot of new new standards and regulations. Yeah. Uh, how, would, how would Title 24 and some of the standards that you're trying to implement Well, I'm hoping all, all these things can be integrated. They'll together. be integrated. So they haven't been integrated yet, but this is kind Not of the yet. next the next thing that's yeah. happening. I mean, we're talking yeah. to people at the California Energy Commission mm -hmm. um, and so on on that. Excellent. Because they haven't determined yet. Yeah. What do you see as the future of all this? Well, the future is energy savings for right. people that own homes. Right. And a better way for builders uh -huh. also to build good homes and right. still make some money at it. Yeah, of course. So, I mean, let's I guess let's talk a little bit more about the builders, too. Um, there's, the standards are pretty stringent. Uh, how, how do builders accomplish Well, everything? actually, they aren't stringent. You yeah. require a greater discipline. Okay. Uh, yeah. You know, initially, maybe the first house a builder builds mm -hmm. might be more expensive because they'll be training for his subs and people mm -hmm. like that. But uh, more and more all over the country as we've been building with builders, they say, hey, this is a piece of cake once we figure out how to do it. Right. It's just, you know, a, a different way of doing it, right. like greater quality control, yeah. so on. So what are some steps that builders should take when trying to achieve the Building America well, standards? Well, uh, you know, there, 
the big areas, particularly with the new housing, yeah. is uh, infiltration, mm -hmm. the house is tight. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, but a tight house can be a bad thing mm -hmm. unless you have a good ventilation system. Right, right. So, you know, <clears throat> the best way I can explain it, it's almost like a person. We're, we're lucky mm -hmm. that everything sort of works together. Uh -huh. uh, and same thing with the house. Mm -hmm. Everything should work together. The air conditioning system should be the right size, the heating right. system. The windows. Uh -huh. It's integrated technology. I think maybe it's is the best way to say it. Yeah. Uh, is there any any kind of message that you'd like contractors and builders to take away when when trying to achieve these standards? Well, I'd like I would really like them to keep in touch with us at Department of Energy uh -huh. because we through our research, our Building America research, we're learning an awful right. lot. And like those little discs I uh, have on the table here. Right. Uh, we have bulletins and things of that sort. Uh -huh. We'd like to work with the people. Yeah. You know, er, <laughs> no one wants to build a bad yeah. house. It's just right. in many cases uh, they don't under understand uh -huh. how they can do better. Yeah, a lot. A lot of it seems just you know getting all the right information yeah. and being able to keep keep touch with all these standards. Yeah, this is and very true. What are what are some of the liability issues that arise when when builders? Well, are liability is. <laughs> Maybe it's a harder subject to talk about. Not as fun yeah. to talk about, I suppose. But, but, here, but here again, I, I think that uh, as the standards are, are used yeah. and, the, and the house is tested and so on, the liability mm -hmm. issues are a lot less. Mm -hmm. I yeah. mean, you know, it, it is a matter right. of, of having it done right. And yeah. what I like about the fact with our seal, th this certifies it was done right. Right, right. So, so it's just... So someone can't come in... Uh, and say, oh, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And say, well, hey, the house will rate it. Here's how it came out. Uh -huh. So here's, here's his performance. So builders can find all these standards on your website and on the disc that you've got here, yeah. for instance? Yeah. Yeah. No, it's, it's, it's a matter. Look, there are so many builders in the country. How, yeah. how do we work with them? Right. And, you know, people say, well, why don't you pay us to build an energy efficient house? No. Yeah. No, that, that's not our role. The role of DOE right. is to work with people, and, you, and we can't put things uh -huh. in the ground itself. So. You develop the standards and the science yeah. behind it. Yeah, you know, here yeah. in California, we work with, well, we have both the energy, uh, Davis Energy Group, uh -huh. one of the Building America teams. We have Consul in Stockton, another team. We work very close with the University of California, Lawrence Berkeley Laboratory. They're doing a lot of our research. In fact, you know, our new Secretary of Energy yeah. came from came yeah, from excellent. there. That's excellent. So, uh, wow. so what's what's uh, something new and exciting in in all of this that's coming up soon that you would maybe we can end on? I think the uh, exciting research that's coming up is some of the work uh, on some of the new windows. Yeah. You know, we're making more energy efficient windows, uh -huh. uh, reducing the cost of those. Yeah. And also, you know the Everyone always is worrying about the, the cost of photocells. Well, right. here again, those are the, as the production increases, those are going down. Yeah, excellent. So, uh, you know, being a perpetual optimist, right. I think so things are going So you think gonna... solar energy will take off? <laughs> well, I think it'll take off. Yeah. But the important thing, and we do a lot of work with Habitat, mm -hmm. is if you build a house for $100,000, mm -hmm. it's very hard unless you get an awful lot of incentive from the state to put on the photocells. Right. But there are so many things you can do in that house that don't cost much money. Yeah. Uh, you know, a lot of people say, oh, I'm going to put in $30,000 worth of new windows. Yeah. And they do. And hey, my house is still not good. Well, <laughs> if that $30,000 has been spent maybe in right. tightening up the house. You've uh, be been better spent, maybe, yeah. huh? So this is, this is the message we're trying to get across. And it's, right. it's, it's difficult. Uh, yeah, building green is not easy, and no. building energy efficient is certainly not easy. No, but, but I think that I think we're making progress. Great. Well, thank you so much for talking to me. Oh, my um, pleasure. And thank you from Builderoo. Okay. And let's, have, like I say, let's keep in touch. And we'll definitely keep in touch. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And we're off from Builderoo TV. <laughs>